What's going on? Cliff Abel, 10 year vet, uh, Super Bowl champ, pro bowler, and I'm ready to take you guys through our NFL Fit workout. It's all body weight, don't have to worry about it. You got here to have a good time, have fun, get that heart rate going, get a good sweat, but also look fit for the summer, baby. It's on its way. So let's jump right into it. We're gonna start with a warm up, then again, like I said, it's gonna be a full body workout. We're gonna do some push up, some body squats, and a wide range of different things in between. And of course, you got these abs, baby. So let's jump into it. First things first, what you're gonna need, you're gonna need a jump rope for the warm up. You're gonna need a bench or a chair of some sort to be able to step up on, but also do some dips. And that's all you really need in a mat to, to get down and get, get dirty and get this thing going, baby. Let's roll. All right, for our warm up, we got jump ropes. Now, if you don't have a jump rope, all you can do is you can just stand in place and just keep it going. Again, just get that blood going, just get that a nice little sweat going. So, we're starting off. One in your arm, 15 seconds off. Let's get it going. Let's start it off. Keep it going now. The first 30 seconds, you'll feel fine. That last 30 seconds, you're gonna start to burn. That's okay. You need that to warm the body up. Keep a nice little sweat going. Keep it up. How you feeling? Let's roll. You can switch it up from side to side if you like. Every 10 seconds, you can switch it up wherever you need. Yeah, let's roll. We got about five seconds left. We got 15 seconds up. There we go. Take a deep breath, stand up tall, shake it out if you need to. So we got about 10 seconds left. We're gonna jump right back into it for another minute. Again, you can go side to side if you need, you can do whatever you need. Let's go! Again, like I said, you can switch it back and forth. You can get fancy with it if you like. Go ahead and do your normal jump. Let's roll. Halfway there. Oh, now we got there, sorry. We got this. Come on now, it's easy, let's go. We rolling. We got about 20 counts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I said, you can switch it up. It's gonna burn a little bit. This is the one. And ah, good job, good job, good job. Keep it up. Let's roll. We got about three more sets of that. Got 15 seconds off right now. Jump right back into it, baby. Let's go. Got about five, four, three, two, one. Let's get it. Stay on your toes, good on your feet. Bro. You won't have some fun. Hey, let's be great today, baby. Let's have fun. Trying to get that summertime. Beach body going. Gotta start somewhere, right? I'm with you. Have some fun with you. That's right there. See you. Okay, we got about 15 seconds. Let's roll. Let's finish strong. Even if you mess up, let's go. Let's keep finish. We got to finish up. Oh, I'm going to pick up. Be good. We got five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Yeah, let's go. We got two more sets left. Feeling good, got a nice little sweat going. Got five seconds, knock this out strong, baby. Let's go. Two, one, right back into it. By now, probably burning a little bit, that's okay. You no, know, I said it's gonna be easy. We're gonna enjoy it, we're 
and have fun. The grind is part of it. We'll be happy to finish it off. But you got to, got to warm up correctly. Get ready for your workout. There we go. We're halfway there. See you. Keep getting after the control. Let's have fun. Okay. 15 seconds. Let's finish strong. Oh, yeah. Five, four, three, two, one. There we go. One last set. Yeah, I'm getting going with this. Good. That's what we need. That's what we need. We got about 10 seconds. One last set to finish strong. We'll get us a breathing. Jump right into that workout, baby. Let's go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Yeah, last one. You can do one thing. We're going to work hard. We're going to have fun. We're going to enjoy the process and be happy with the results. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Halfway there. Let's go. Should be getting a nice little sweat, nice little burn going. Yeah, about 20 seconds. Finish strong. You know when you mess up, finish strong. Let's go. We got 15. Yeah. Got to it. Huh? Woo! I'm gonna start messing up now. Let's go. Oh, we got five seconds. We got five, four, three, two, one. Good job. I like it. I like it. It's a way to warm up. Let's get on to our workout, baby. All right, so we're doing intervals. We're gonna do 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off, right? And we're gonna do three sets of each workout. So we wanna get that burn, we wanna get that sweat going. And the first thing we need to do is 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off for push-up. Now, obviously, there's a wide range of different ways you can do push-ups. So you can start off with regular push-up, or we can modify it with your knees on the ground. Same thing. But listen, all the way up, all the way down, all right? We're gonna start this thing off in about five seconds. All the way up, all the way down. And if it's burning and, and you need to stop, stop up top, all right? Let's roll, we got, we got 30 seconds on, let's go. There we go, let's go. Keep it up, once you get tired, up top. Time. Shake it off. You can stand up. Shake it off. Do what you need to do. Loosen it up. We'll be right back in it. 30 more seconds. All right. We got about 22 seconds to go. It's going to burn the next few steps. The next few steps. Or right, then um, it's going to get a little bit harder. So we got to keep it up. All right. We got about 10 seconds left. Let's have fun with this. It's going to burn. It's going to burn. We got about five seconds. Three, two, one, let's roll. Keep it up. Let's go, in about 15 seconds. Woo, let's go, let's have some fun. I see you got about five seconds. Get one more in, let's go. Time, good job. Oh yeah, it's gonna burn. Again, if you need to modify it, put your knees on the ground, all the way up, all the way down. Again, if you need to rest, rest it up top. Let's have fun, we got one last set left. Let's have some fun, baby. We got about 12 seconds. We got about 12 seconds to knock this out. Just start setting up, get ready. We got five seconds to go. Three, two, one, let's roll. Let's go. 
Let's go. I need you. I need you. Get in there. Let's go. You got about 20 seconds. Come on. I know it's hard. I know it's hard. Let's go. I'm with you. I'm watching you. Let's go. Okay, keep the drill now. Let's go. Let's stay on. There you go. We need that rest on top. I see you. You got about five seconds. Four, three, two, one. There you go. I like it. I like it. Now we're done with push-ups for the day. That was our upper body, that was our chest. We got a nice little burn. All right, let's keep it up, keep it up. Okay, now we've got our, our, our push-ups done. Now we're gonna get some legs, baby. We're gonna do step-ups. Now, step-ups can get a little challenging. So if we need to alternate or change it up, we can. But the first drill is one foot up. Make sure you bring that foot up and right back down, all right? Woo, almost stumbled on me. And then you switch them out. The next foot up, bring it right back down. Now, to alternate or an alternative workout would be to do lunges. Reach in, reach back out. Switch them out. All right? Let's have some fun with this. We got about 20 seconds before we start. So take your deep breath and we're going to get after it, baby. We'll have some fun. Again, we're doing three sets of this. Alternate and math effect. Keep a, head, uh, keep a count in your head so the next time we can try to beat that number as well, right? So we got about five seconds. We're right back at it, baby. Let's go. Start in. Now, let's go. Let's have some fun with this. There you go. There you go. I see you working. I see you working. Let's go. And it's going to burn. Stretch those legs. Woo! And that's like a good old leg workout. Bring them up. Bring them up. Let's go. Let's go. Got about five seconds. See if we can get one more in. See if we can get one more in. Time. Good job. Good job. Again, as these get harder, as these get harder, again, we can do the alternative, which is the lunges. They don't get any easier, it's just a different way of doing it. Let's go. Let's go. All right, we got nine seconds. Come out, whatever that number is in the back of your head. Let's try to get to it. Let's go. Time is rolling. Yeah. Come on now, let's keep it going. I thought I, thought, I, thought I see somebody stop. Let's go, let's keep it going. I'm with you. We're gonna ride this thing on out. Let's roll. I see. I see you. Get that leg up there. I see you. Got about five seconds left. Let's finish strong. Let's get one more in. Let's go. Good job. Woo! I see y'all working. We came to work today. All right. You got to get the core right. Without the core, you can't do nothing on any sport or any field or anything, right? So we got to make sure our core is right. So we're jumping right into it. 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. We're going to start off. We're going to do bicycles. Bicycles, all right, is you keep your knee up at 90 degrees, then you twist it to the opposite knee. You're gonna do that for 30 seconds. And then we'll take a break, and then we're gonna do that again for another 30 seconds. And then we'll jump right back into the workout, baby. We got five seconds to, to jump into it. Let's roll. Let's have some fun, get the core right. Let's get it, 30 seconds on. It can be slow or fast. I prefer a little bit slower, because you get a deeper burn. But it does get hard, guess what? Our work pays off. It's a cliche, but we make it happen. Let's 
very true. When you are dedicated to the trap. Yeah, ten seconds, baby. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Three, two, one. Yes, yes, yes. Now we got 30 seconds off. 30 seconds off. We got one more set of these abs. And we jump right back to the workout, baby. Got to keep these things right. Plus, everybody wants to, you know, show off the stomach. You know, you know walking with the beach and everything else, right? And we can going to get it by working for it. Let's go ahead. Let's go get it. Got 10 seconds. 10 seconds. We're right back into it, fellas. Ladies and gents, we are right back into it. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Yeah. Second like set will be a little bit harder now. We can do it. And if you need a break, break up top like this. Keep those legs up. It's gonna burn still, but keep them up. Let's go. We got 15 seconds. I see you. I see you working. Yeah. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. There we go. Good job. We are in there. Let's roll. Let's roll. Good job. Good job. Let's take a quick breather. We got 30 seconds before we jump right into the next exercise. Right? And we got to dip. So get your chair out and dips. So dips are all, all we're doing is right here. So all we're doing down and up for 30 seconds. Let's go. Three, two. One, let's go. Let's go. I like it. Up and down. All the way up, all the way down. It can be a slow one. All the way up, all the way down. If you need a breather, don't put your butt down. Don't put your bottom of the, of the chair or whatever you're holding on to. Just stay up top. It's gonna burn. It's a good burn. Let's go. I like it. You guys are working. I like it. Time. Now you sit down for a second. It's all the time you ever sit down in my workout, baby. All the time. Let's have some fun. Let's go. We got 20 seconds. I don't even like to sit down, but sit down for a second. We got 15 seconds. Let's have some fun. Let's get better. Let's enjoy the journey. Let's enjoy the process. Yes, we got eight seconds. We got eight seconds. We got five, four, three. Two, let's roll. Now an alternative. So to make it harder, the further you push your legs out. It's a little bit easier, but you scoot them back in a little bit. I'm in between. I'm still trying to get right, just like everybody else, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get it. You tired? Up here. Let's roll. Let's roll. We got 10 seconds. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Time. Let's go. All right, this is time to get you some water. It's time to, you know, shake it out a little bit. Those arms will feel a little, a little funny. We got one more set left, baby. We got one more set. Let's have some fun with it. Let's have some fun with it. We got 15 seconds. Let's roll. Hard work pays off. Always believe it. Let's go. It's going to burn. It's going to hurt. But what we don't do, we don't quit. Let's go. Let's have some fun. We got three. Two, one, let's roll. Come on. There you go. I see you. I see you. Further, I see you. Put a little strength in there. Let's go. You got 20 seconds. Again, if you get low, get a little tired, keep it up top right here. Don't, don't sit down. You don't need that. All right? You got 10 seconds. All the way down, all the way up. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Three. Two, one. Woo! Yes, yes, yes. It burns. We got 30 seconds off. The next workout, these can get a little difficult, but it's just body squats, baby. And I'll show you how to make it a little bit harder, but we're just doing body squats. We're gonna give you side angle. All the way down, all the way up. All right? Make sure you squeeze at the top. You squeeze those glutes at the top. All your power is in the glutes, right? Let's have some fun. We've got about five seconds. Let's roll. Three, two, one. All right, let's roll. Try to get as low as possible. You, want, you don't want to be lower than parallel to the ground. Let's go. There you go, squeeze at the top. Working. 
Knees are gonna turn. The legs always burn the most. Let's go. Let's go. Let's have some fun with this. I see you. I see you working. Time. Good job. Good job. Shake the legs out a little bit. You got about 30 seconds. 25 to be exact. We're jumping right back into it. I like the way you guys are getting after it, baby. I see you. I see you. Working on being great. Let's go. We got 15 seconds. Let's work. I'm a little below too. It's all good. That's how hard it is. We're gonna have some fun with it, baby. Five seconds. We working hard today. Three, two, one. Let's jump right back into it. Let's go. Squeeze at the top. Squeeze at the top. Get low. You're parallel to the ground. You should. Your quads, your legs are parallel to the ground as much as possible. Don't go past that 90 degrees. Squeeze at the top. Yeah. We have a fun today. We're getting better today. Yeah. And roll. I'm up there. One more set. That's all we got. Everybody got one more in them, right? Everybody got one more in them. Let's go. Let's have some fun with this. Let's enjoy it. Check those legs off. Check them out. Take a deep breath. Get you some water. Got 15 seconds to hit it hard. All right? Let's have some fun. Let's go. 10 seconds. Yeah. Let's move up. Let's go. Let's go, champ. We got four seconds. Let's go. Right back at it. Three, two, one. Let's go. Last set. Y'all got one minute, right? You got one set in this. Let's go. Let's go. Now, if you need a breather, obviously you got to stand straight up. You don't stand up there too long. You jump right back into it. Jump right back into it. There we go. We got 14 seconds. I like it. I like it. Come on now. Let's stop. Hey, we'll stop one now. Let's keep it going. There you go. There you go. There you go. Two, one, time. I see you getting that last set in. Getting that last breath in. I see you. Good job. Guess what we're back to? We're back to the lab, baby. Hey, without the core, you can't do anything. Without the core, you cannot do anything. Your core isn't strong. I don't care how strong your upper body is. I don't care how strong your lower body is. Your core isn't strong. Nothing you can have. Nothing you can have. All right? Just stay on top of it. We've got five sets. Well, actually, you know what? For the core workout. Now, I call these toe touches. Again, your feet is at 90 degrees. Toe touches. Make sure you keep that core tight and make sure the middle of your back is touching the floor. You never want that arch in your back, all right? You can see what's in your back. So again, make sure your entire back is flat to the floor and then you just toe touch it. Now, the further out you reach, the more difficult it gets, okay? So let's jump into it. Again, if you need a break, just leave it up top, all right? Three, two, one, let's roll. Yeah. We alternated. All right, don't go past the 90 degrees on your leg, all right? On your knees. Let's go. You want that leg parallel to the ground and keep it going. Slow, nice burn. Yes, you're gonna love it. You're gonna feel it. It's all good though. The core is most important. Of all the workouts, the core is the most important. Let's have some fun. There we go. Three, two, one. That last set in. There you go. That last right here. Good job, good job. We are here to work, baby. We are here to work. I see you. I see you getting that one, kid. Let's go. We got 20 seconds. Let's have some fun with this. All right. We got 20 seconds or 15 seconds. We're right back at it. Again, if you need a breather while you're doing it, keep it up top. Keep your legs up top. Your legs to the ground. It's doing a good workout. We got five seconds. We got five seconds. Let's roll. Three, two, one. Let's roll. Make sure your back is staying flat to the ground. Don't put any stress on your back. Let's go. Again, remember, the further you reach out, the more difficult it gets. There you go. Yeah. Let's go. See you. Oh, it's going to burn. So, again, the core is the most important piece in the entire, in all of this, right? The core, dictates everything else, everything else in your body. So if your core wasn't strong as the defensive lineman, if your core wasn't strong, guess what? Those old linemen will move you up that rock. I don't care how much you weigh, care how strong you are at the top. 
If your core isn't strong, they can get you and move you out of the way. And you won't keep your job for long, right? So we need to keep that core tight and everything. If you're a basketball player, same exact thing, right? Down in the post, you need all that strength down there to get to move people out of the way. And once you build that core up, everything else tires off of that core. So that's exactly why I think the core is extremely, extremely important for this whole process. We got one more set of those on the back end, but we're up right now. We're good, we're good, we're good. All right. So this is going to be a little bit of a, a burnout as well. So we're doing our shoulders now. Get back in the push-up position. Now once we get up, all we're doing, we're doing right hand out, right hand back in. Left hand out, left hand back in. And we're going to alternate. Going back and forth through this whole process again. Let me show you a different angle. We're on, so we're up, push-ups, right in, right out. Right out, right in. And left out, left in. All right, we got 10 seconds before we start. So get your swig if you need one. We start in seven seconds. These are gonna burn too. Now let's have some fun with it. All right, three, two, one, let's roll. You gotta have the shoulders strong, right? As a D lineman, your shoulders, your arms, your core is strong. You probably can't move that big offensive lineman in front of you, right? You probably won't be able to disengage with them. So it's extremely important to make sure you're strong. Your, your shoulders are on point, right? And if you need a breather, right here, okay? If you need a breather, stop right at the push up, but do not put that knee down, because we need that strength, baby. We got four seconds left. Get one more rep in, get one more rep in. Let's go. Good job. Good job. Yes, yes, it's gonna burn. It's gonna burn, we're gonna have fun with it. Let's go. It's extremely important. Those shoulders, to make a tackle, you gotta bring that shoulder in, right? Your shoulder's weak. They're running through it, so you gotta make sure that shoulder is strong. So you gotta make sure the shoulders are strong. You got 10 seconds left before our next set. You will sweat. That's part of the workout, baby. You will have fun. That's part of it as well. Three, two, one. Let's roll. You will also feel your abs start to burn because this is somewhat of a plank. All right? Let's go. Let's go. Wait up. There you go. I see you. Keep going. Keep going. Stand up tall. There you go. There you go. You got five seconds. You got four, three, two, one. One more set, baby. One more. Like I said, you can do one thing one time. Every time. Let's go. All we need. All we need is one more set. Finish strong. 30 seconds. Everybody got 30 seconds to work in them, right? 30 seconds of work, let's go. Got 15 seconds. Let's go. We'll watch you this time, let's roll. What we got? Got five, four, three, two, one. Let's roll. Okay, starting off strong, I like it. I like it, okay. You get right back into it. I know that's work by yourself. Let's go, let's go. There you go. 15 seconds left. Jump right back into it with you guys. Let's go. I just need to see what you're doing. I know it's hard. I know it's hard. Nobody said it's ever going to be easy. Let's roll. Got four, three, two, one. All right. Take the arms out. Take the shoulders out a little bit. Let's go. Let's have some fun. All right. We got two more workouts left. That's all we got. Can we finish that strong? We got two more workouts left. Six sets, that's all we got. Let's go. I like it. All right, next workout. Do you break? I'm gonna tell you what the next workout is. Next workout, we're just doing body lunges. All right, if you did, if you did the lunge during step ups, it's okay, you got another set of three done. That's all you gotta do, so again, you wanna lift that leg up, reach out, bring it back, then alternate. Bring it back, all right? We got 15 seconds before we start. Grab your swig if you need it. If not, just knock it out. Let's be great. Let's be great. We're gonna have some fun today. We got five seconds, baby. Five seconds. You're jumping right into it. Make sure you're off today. There we go. There we go. Uh -huh. Make sure you keep that count in your head. So you know when that set, that third set comes back, that's the number you're trying to get. Yeah. Yeah. 
Opposite leg, opposite arm. Meaning, whatever leg is front, opposite arm is front. Time. How you feel? It? I know. I know it burns. I know it burns. Let's have some fun, baby. We in here. We got 20 seconds left. Come on. I see you. If you can, stand up tall. Let's roll. All right, three, two, one. Jump right back into it. Let's go, lunges. Let's go, champ. Got 10 seconds left. Got 10 seconds left. Let's roll. We got five, 
four, three, two, let's go. Again, these laps will be a little bit harder, obviously. Again, take a knee if you need to, but make sure you stand parallel to the ground as much as possible, at least, and keep that core engaged, all right? Let's go. We only got 15 seconds. You can do anything for 15 seconds, right? Let's go. 10, yeah. Woo, woo, woo. That's it. Four, three, two, one. Whoa, before you take off your lead, hey, the most important part of it all is the cool down. You gotta get that stretch in. You gotta cool down after the workout. It's extremely important because you don't want that like the acid or anything building up and you also get a little tight. Stretching is extremely, extremely important as an athlete to keep you loose and also so you don't pull any muscle. So let's jump right into it. So we did legs. So of course, you gotta stretch the hamstrings out, right? So feet forward. And just reach out and try to touch your toes. Now, I got long arms, so I guess I'm cheating a little bit. You should be able to reach out and touch your toes. If not, reach for your ankles. But just try to keep it there as long. Just keep it there for about 20 seconds. And then we'll jump right into a different one. Again, stretching is extremely, extremely important. As a professional athlete, before I went to bed, every single night, I stretch. That's how important it is. I'm going to stay in it for about five more seconds. There we go. And this right here stretches out the hamstrings and a little bit of your calves. Second one, kick that right foot back. Again, same thing. Make sure that toe is pointing straight up. All right. You kick this back one. Uh, you kick it back, and you reach with the opposite arm. So your left foot's forward, your right hand is down. Just jump right into it. Again, just another good stretch for the hamstrings and a little bit of your calves as well. Again, if you need to modify, you grab your ankles, maybe you can grab your foot if possible. But again, keep that toe pointing straight up and knock it out, baby. Five, four, three, two, one. Now, of course, if you do one to one side, you gotta do it to the other, right? So let's flip it over, put that right foot forward, left foot back. Again, toe pointing straight up, reach with your opposite arm. Let's go. There we go. Again, modifications, angle, foot. We try to grab the top of the toe. Got five seconds, five, four, three, two, one. There we go. All right, we did a lot of abs, right? So you gotta make sure you stretch those things out too. Right? So you flip over, these are called the cobra stretch. So you're gonna try to push it. You're gonna try to get, you're gonna be face down all the way, and then you're gonna just push up and try to keep your hips as close as possible to the ground. Now me, I can't necessarily keep them all the way down there, but you get the gist of it. You got about 10 seconds of this. Good old stretch for your abs. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. And this is a good resting position. If you know where you that stuff, you know about this. Good resting position, but also a good stretch on the shoulders, right? You do a little bit of shoulder work. It's a good stretch. Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Now let's get a little quad stretch in. Now, if you got that chair, or that bench or whatever it is that you might have, you might need to hold on to it a little bit, but as you get a little bit more balance in yourself, you stand up and grab that, that ankle, try to bring it straight down. Try to make sure your knee is pointing down, straight down to the ground as much as possible. As you get better, to get a better stretch, push your, your hip forward and it puts more stretch on your hip flexor and your quads. There you go. But again, if you need some assistance, grab on to something. And as you get better at it, you rest you, put that hand down. All right, again, well, if you want to do one side, we're gonna do it to the other. Let's go. Yeah, uh-oh, uh -oh, bounce. There we go. Now you guys did a great job today. Cool down is just as important as getting that workout in. All right, two more stretches. We did 
those push-ups early on, the ch chest probably a little tight. Grab, it, grab your right arm, swing it across, put that left arm in front of it, and stretch the shoulder down. Appreciate you guys for checking in with me. Cliff Averill, signing off, NFL Fit, baby. Let's go.